All right, in this video, I want to show you guys a decimal division problem where the divisor is also a decimal. So we have 45 hundredths divided by 5 tenths. And it turns out we cannot have a decimal in our divisor. So we have to do something uh, to change our 5 tenths into a whole number. And how do we do that? We're going to multiply our 5 tenths by 10. And if we multiply our divisor by 10, we need to multiply our dividend by 10 as well. So hopefully you guys recall that whenever we multiply or divide a decimal by a power of 10, we can use our old friend, Mr. DL. And recall that stands for multiply right, divide left. So in this problem, we're multiplying two decimals by a power of 10. So we're going to be moving our decimal points to the right. And because we only have one zero, you see I'm coloring them in with the number 10. Uh, that signifies we have one power of 10, so we're going to move our decimal point one place to the right. So I'm going to move my decimal and my divisor one place to the right. And I'm going to move my decimal and my dividend one place to the right. So I'm going to go ahead and rewrite this problem uh, below. I now have five as my divisor. And in my dividend, I no longer have 45 hundredths. I have... four and five tenths. So recall that the decimal point in a decimal division problem goes straight up into our quotient here. And then we just divide like normal. We know that five goes into 45 nine times. And so the quotient or the answer to 45 hundredths divided by five tenths is nine tenths.